Hey guys and welcome to this another episode of the uh, Raspberry Pi series. So in the last video of the Raspberry Pi series I shown you unbox the uh, Raspberry Pi 3 uh, Model Beast which is the latest generation Raspberry Pi from the Raspberry Pi company. So in this video we're gonna see how to get started uh, with the uh, uh, by putting the uh, Raspberry Pi into the case because the most of the time you have to uh, you need a case because if you don't need a case and also it, you will be ended up at getting some damage to the boat so this case is available on amazon.in so i'll leave the link in the description you can go ahead and buy uh, from the link in the description so anyway so this is the case that i bought officially from uh, raspberry and uh, around a uh, three four nine rupees uh, indian rupees and you can get it on amazon.in so anyway so in this video i'm going to show you uh putting the heat sinks onto the processor and some of the chips on the uh, motherboard also we're going to be put the raspberry pi in the case so let's go ahead and unbox this one and see and how to put this raspberry pi uh right inside the uh, case so anyway i'm going to keep this boat away so this is the uh uh, case that I got it's actually the uh, white red combination so I'm gonna go ahead and open this one when you first time open so you're gonna see some heat sinks and I'm gonna show you how to uh, put onto the processor and some of the chips on the uh, board and then after that you're gonna see this is the case so definitely I recommend you to buy this case this is the official Raspberry Pi made case and you can get it from Amazon and I'm gonna open this one so when you first time open, you're gonna see this is the beautiful red-white combination. So personally, I like it a lot. So I'm gonna put the boat aside for now. So then what you're gonna do is you have to open the top plate like this, and it's gonna be open. Also, there are some side strips is also there. These are the two side strips. You have to open these side strips like this. I'm gonna put aside. Same thing with this one also. You can simply open. After that, you can go ahead and finally open the top notch like this. So you will be ended up seeing all of these things. Uh, first of all, I'm going to put this aside. Uh, first, we're going to see the attaching the let's say uh, the heat sinks to the uh, processor, and some of the chips is here. And we can also put the, the heat sink onto this chip also. This is the main processor, which is the heart of the boat. So we're going to go ahead and take this one of this one. And. Uh, first time so when you open this and you're gonna be see this is the uh, the back you're gonna see a sticker if you remove the sticker there's a thermal paste right uh, bottom of the sticker and then I'm gonna put this one there are also two uh, heat sinks so if you lose one and they will gonna be also provide another one so I'm gonna put one so we only need a one so I'm gonna put this one aside so now what we need is we're gonna just go ahead and take this sticker off so let me go ahead and take this sticker off so there you go. There's a very okay. I don't know how to take this one. We can take this way. There you go. When you first time you will take this is actually there's nothing. There is some gum is there, so maybe so I'm gonna be put to the abode right away. So make sure that you're putting in exact direction. So no matter what direction that you're putting. So make sure that it's supposed and um, you put like this. Here you go. There you go. Now uh, we have ins uh, put the uh, heat sink onto the processor, which is the main processor. So what is this going to do is it's actually the aluminum made, so which is uh, uh, which is going to dissipate the heat coming from the processor that keeps the processor cool every time. And another way, there is another thing is there, we're going to put another, uh, this is the small uh, thermal component, th sorry, a small, uh, let's say heat sink uh, to this chip, we can apply to that one also. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off, this is actually, there you go, another small sticker, I'm going to keep it inside. So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, put this one also onto this front board, okay. Basically, there you go. Now we stick this, everything is perfect now. So now we have uh, uh, connected the uh, both heat sinks to the processor and another chip onto the boat. And now, all right, now after the uh, putting the two heat sinks, and we need to take this main plate, the bottom of this plate, 
and then we can put this uh, Raspberry Pi onto this motherboard so onto this case and then the top plate case and make sure everything is going to be done so you can see these clicking sounds and now we're going to put these side strips there's a side strips in this direction that we're going to go ahead and put this way and this one uh, make sure this wall going to be in this direction so and final thing you have to put the case and uh, that's it and now you get ready uh, to connect all of your cables this is the easiest way of putting the case and which is going to be provide and going to give you a uh, very uh, good look for the uh, raspberry thing so anyway so that's it in this video so in the next video we're going to see the uh, connecting to the computer and also what are the cables that we are required and uh, what are the power supply and what are the charges that is required to connect to the raspberry pi and also we're going to see the installing the uh, basic operating system onto this raspberry pi so that's it for this video so if you like it thumbs up if you don't like it dislike the video and i will see you in my